Cosmos 186 Russian Cosmos minus 186 meaning Cosmos 186 and Cosmos 188 respectively Cosmos 188 were two unmanned Soviet Union spacecraft that incorporated a Soyuz program descent module for landing scientific instruments and test objects Topic <laughs> Mission The two Soviet spacecraft made the first fully automated space docking in the history of space exploration on October 30, 1967. Mutual search, approach, mooring, and docking were automatically performed by the IGLA system on board Cosmos 186. After 3.5 hours of joint flight, the satellites parted on a command sent from the Earth and continued to orbit separately. Officially, both made a soft landing in a predetermined region of the Soviet Union, Cosmos 186 on October 31, 1967 and Cosmos 188 on November 2, 1967. According to Boris Chertok, "...one of the vehicles was destroyed by the Emergency Destruction System." C.B. Chertok, Rockets and People, Volume 4, Chapter 8, page 156. Because of the lethal outcome of both the Soyuz 1 and the U.S. Apollo 1 missions earlier that year it was decided to proceed with unmanned flights first. But because the Soviet Union had no ground stations outside its own territory, this meant the docking had to be done fully automated. After the first attempt failed a flyby at a distance of 900 meters, the second attempt succeeded over the South Atlantic. However, this docking was not entirely successful either, the modules were mechanically docked, but not electrically. Also, the maneuver had cost more fuel than anticipated. This mission proved it possible to launch smaller parts and assemble them in space, thus eliminating the need for exceedingly large rockets for larger undertakings like a space station. External links Text comes from NASA NSSDC Master Catalogue